Hey guys, so the other day I had someone take my bank card information, which is kind of upsetting because they went and spent like 50 bucks on things that I didn't ever get and they probably didn't need. The thing that really upset me about all this is that I had to talk to the people from the bank. And not that the people from the bank aren't lovely folks, it's just that sometimes I don't like automated voice- no, not sometimes. Always I hate going through automated menus because they go down something like this. Thank you for calling the Bank of America Fraud Detection Center. If you would like to complete this transaction in English, please press 1 now. If this is a problem with your credit card, please press 1. If this is a problem with your debit card, please press 2. Thank you. Please enter your 16-digit account number at this time. Thank you so much. If we can have you hold for us for just one moment, we'll get you with a customer service representative. Alrighty, so it seems like everything is going right at this point, right? But then this happens, and you just want to off yourself. Before we can connect you with a customer service representative, we need you to listen to the following options from our new menu. Please listen carefully as options have changed. If you would like to do please choose one. If you would like to choose option number two, Talking which is so fast. please press two. Option number three. Option number four. At this point, this is where I start the signature Josh Laka move. Have seizure on the keyboard technique, which goes something like this. Option number five. No, option number six. We're so sorry, but that's not one of the following options. Please choose from the five. <laughs> now, the other issue is should you be able to get hold of a person even after the craziness of the automated message button seizure inducing craziness that you've just endured, you might get a person, but then of course this happens. Thank you for calling Bank of America's Broad Detection Services. My name is Sally. How may I help oh, you Oh, yeah. Today? Um, I just wanted to um, call and talk about um, my card has, has had some fraudulent activity on it, and I was wondering uh, about shutting that down. I'm so sorry about the inconvenience, but I'm not actually have any power to help you. I'm going to have to transfer you. But I got an email from you guys giving me this number to call you and talk to you about that. Yeah, I'm so sorry about the inconvenience. Can you hold, sure, please? Sure, I'll hold. Thank you. So after waiting for what seems like forever, I mean, you could probably sit through every Harry Potter film in one sitting, and they still wouldn't have come back to help you yet. But just when you think that your time is done, and you're about ready to talk to a person because it does that fake ring on you, this happens. Thank you so much for holding for us, but I'm sorry we're not going to be able to connect your call. You have a great Fuck day. Fuck you! Gah! <sighs> And it would be okay if this happened just once, but it doesn't happen just once. It happens over and over and over until you've spent about a good chunk of your afternoon just trying to get to a certain person. And by that point, you are just so frustrated and pissed off at the world that this is how you then talk to any human being that should even grace the other side of the phone line. Hi, my name is Wendy. I work in the fraud department at Bank of America. I'm a fraud specialist. How may I help you today? Wendy, I swear to God, I have been on the phone with you folks for 12 hours. If you don't put me on the phone with an actual human being from the claims department, I will shoot myself in the skull. We'll be happy to help you in any moment. Hold on one second, let me find someone. <laughs> so much. <laughs> and then finally, someone talks to you on the phone, you get everything resolved, and all is well in the world. So moral of the story is... Threaten to kill yourself on the phone with the people at the bank, and they will get shit done. But that's it for today. I just wanted to call and share this misadventure with you guys. Um, I told you guys I was going to be making more video updates, and I am. I'm just going to annoy the fuck out of you with them, and I hope you enjoy them. That's it for today. I will have a new video in... Two days. Two days. Give me something to talk about. It'll be awesome. Bye, guys.